keep the channel off. More real estate for the game. And it is a pretty video game. Assuming they uh, up the graphics a little bit. And even the originals are not. Uh, I quite like the graphics of. Alright. Well, see you later then. And, uh... Well, oh, wait, shit, pull and pull, hold up, hold up, first this. Pull and pull. And eat. Welcome back to the War Council, bro. Hope you're still enjoying yourself. And let's check out this video game. I'm a little excited. I know it shouldn't be. It, it's 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 a relaxing video game. It's not gonna be Doom. It's not gonna be in your face. It's just gonna be. This is the farthest that I could take you on company space bugs, Robin. You sure you space bugs. The research is in everything. It is to me and Sam. I need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from all terrors eyes. All right, maybe maybe it's not very chill. Maybe. I didn't expect that kind of intro. Uh, I'm not, not sure what I expected. All right, shit's falling into the sky. Or rather, onto the planet. Okay. It's not a drink, this is a uh, kind of milk, which is kind of like a different kind of milk. Okay, we're already crashing. I mean, the cannon has been just deactivated. We should not, we should not be crashing right now. What are you doing? Oh no. This is- this is your fault! There was no alien cannon blasting us out of orbit. This was your fault! You ran into a meteor storm! Uh, your- your, your shit's on fire. <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Boom. Okay. We ha okay. This. All right. I see a lot of familiar stuff, and I see a lot of non-familiar stuff. First of all, we're being showered in asteroids. I feel like we should take cover, but there is no cover. All right. Walking's the same. Do we have a cool Altera? No, no Altera. No. Uh, hold up. On survival. Who needs survival tips? We got this. Blueprints, beacon manager, we get absolutely nothing. Perfect. No Altera though, this is a bit of a problem. Okay, now we have temperature. This is a bad thing. Alright, we have one nutrient block. This is all ice. Ice covered. Ice encased in snow. Okay. Well. Let us attempt to find shelter and I'd say make a fire, but I'm not sure if we're gonna have the time to to make a fire. Don't, don't buy, don't buy that. Up to shit, we might need that. Okay, give me that, give me that. And I need that, and I need that. I'm half tempted to eat a neutron block like right now. You know what? Let's do it. All right. That flare is not needed right now. What the? Yeah, 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 yeah. I know it's cold, I know it's cold. I'm trying to find shelter, but there's nothing here. This is not my... I was expecting a chill experience, not to be in immediate death. Now, this may not be oxygen, instead it's... Yes, I know hypothermia is imminent. Thanks! You look... You look... You are not good. You look like... You, you look like a fucking... You look like those hypnofish. Hypnofish. Only, only instead it's a plant, and it also looks like that thing would eat me. Except it's actually heating me up. Which, uh, you know what, that's pretty cool actually. And there's no, it doesn't look like that thing is gonna pop open from there and reveal a very ugly mouth full of teeth and then just munch, munch, munch your face off. So just heat me up inside. Heat me up inside. Heat me up inside. Save me. All right. Well, now that we have found a uh, secure source of warmth, which, which is... He does seem to be very fixated on me, doesn't he? Why is he very fixated on me? Why why does he keep tracking me? What is what is the advantage of 
having that? What is the... You've... I don't understand the advantage of why a plant would track that. That's more... You know, that's usually any kind of plant that reacts to stuff like that is usually some carnivorous like flytrap or something. So, except this time it's a, it's a, it's a Fred. I think I'm a female actually in this. I suppose we're Fredina now. It's more like a Fredina trap at this point. Environment looks pretty, but I am far away from water, which I'm not sure how I feel about that. Because I have no idea what to expect in the water now. Yeah. Alright, well, now we have oxygen, heat. It, it does it does seem like oxygen has taken a bit of a, a backseat to the temperature. Hmm. Fredina Fox? Yeah, I was exactly thinking the same thing ago. It's like, huh, now we are Fredina. Twin sister of our beloved Fred. We see Fred's family trait wearing its ugly head. And the ability to crash, it does seem that way. Build a scanner and find out. Yep, that's, uh, that's, that's a good point. I don't think I have any blueprints. Well, I will have to go and find some. Alright, first of all, that looks pretty as shit. Second of all, if we are in some sort of... If this game takes place in some sort of, like, Iceland-esque, like, Valhalla environment, I'm... This, this may just turn into, like, a 20-hour stream if it actually does turn out to be that, because that's fucking beautiful, and, and, and the Isla uh, Icelandic icecape is amazing. Okay, so how good is this wetsuit? How good is this wetsuit in keeping you hot? We'll, we'll have to, we'll have to go in with a, with a little bit of temperature, I believe. Alright, now I know there is a marker somewhere there, but... We don't, we don't, we don't, we don't need tips in this video game. We're good. You know what? I'm even going to turn it off. Where, where's the, where's the beacon thing? You know what? No, I don't need to see that draw pod. You know? We don't need help. We know how to play this game. We were pro at the first Subnautica. We did well when we weren't, uh, drunk out of our asses, which we don't do today or any day anymore, somewhat. Wow, that is pretty fucking beautiful. Ah, Siegleit! Ah, I need to scan this. But I don't have a scanner. Oh, they upped the detail. Oh, yes. They definitely upped the detail. Good old limestone gave me that titanium. Alright, I'm already feeling it. Oh, and it switches the oxygen and the temperature. Oh, yes. I already like this. Ooh, barnacles. No, you can break these on the, on the, the reef back, boys. And then we got precious metals. Unfortunately, we can't break them now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I remember this from the from the concept art of the first of Nautica. These, like, massive tendrils which just made this giant, like, stone octopus thing. Except it was kind of... It was just an environment. It wasn't actually an octopus thing. Which was awesome. Which means this is awesome if they applied that concept art in the second game. Which I love it. Bladderfish, I love you. New creature discovered. Air bladder. New blueprint synthesized. Pink rock. Table coral? Oxygen. Oh, okay. Wow, whoa, whoa, whoa. You only give me that 10 seconds in advance now? Ooh. <laughs> 10 seconds is not... It's not the 30 seconds it used to be. And I... And even with 30... Bullseye shroom. Bullseye shroom. Oh, yeah. And now the music comes. Okay, never mind. I already love this game. I'm so sorry, gentlemen. This may just turn into a tw into an impromptu 20-hour one. I didn't mean it to, but you know what? Oh. All right. Let me read a little bit of chat because I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna neglect chat again. We know how it goes. I, I apologize up front. Should I watch or play it myself? That choice is all yours. I will... What the fuck am I supposed to seek shelter? Well, the water, of course. Water is... Is warm? I mean, I imagine it's pretty freezing, right? I'll just uh, grab some, uh, you know. Uh, I do need a fabricator, actually. I need a lot of things. 
Maybe take some bullseye shrooms, man. We'll figure out the purpose of life, man. No, let's 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 survive. Actually, oxygen. I need a fabricator. <laughs> Wait, I didn't actually check in the pod. Maybe I should have. Oh, emergency supply cache. Very nice. I mean, I don't need emergency supplies right now. Game's telling me how to play. Unacceptable. We'll figure it out ourselves. No more ocean madness. Oh, hopeful. Dude, look at this. It's fucking beautiful. They even took the, 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 the like tentacle environment concept from the verse of Nautica and it's, 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 it's awesome. It's really, really cool. Oh, shit. Are you telling me there's just pre-built shit? Okay. Well, that, oh my God. They come with, they come with solar panels now. Oh yeah. Guys, they come with solar panels now. Tesla has invested in these things. Good. Enter base. Found the drop pod. Beautiful. Fabricator, storage. I want to offer my sincerest condolences Who the hell are... the of your sister. Who the hell are you? I want you? to know Sam better towards the end of my mandate with Altera on 4546B. When we were thrown together as base mates at Outpost Zero. She spoke often and fondly of you. I thought you should know. It didn't sit right with me when Altera blamed Sam's death on negligence. The Samantha Ayu I met was many things. Kind, clever, devoted to her work, but never negligent. I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my access to information has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave, and Ooh. there might still be information to be found there. It has a big radio tower, impossible to miss. I okay. Well, I mean, I'll I'll get into I'll, okay, Miss Bench. I will get into the thing. Yeah, don't, 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 don't bore me with dialogue and and guidelines and and goals. Let me let me explore my own thing. Just, psh. oh wait, fabricator. Sustenance. Cook. No, don't cook the bladder fish. We need the bladder fish for water. Shall be fully voiced. Hmm. All right, we got the good old materials we know and love. Copper wire, battery, raboon plant. What the fuck is a raboon plant? Okay, silver ore. Let's go find that. Creep vine sample. Yeah, we still got those. Oh, red creep vine clusters. All right, make some glass. Tools. Uh. Oh, wait, you need a blad? Oh, you just need straight up need the blad. Okay, gotcha. Do you think they removed the the jihad fish? Uh, titanium fiber mesh. We need some creep vine. Okay. Uh, let's store everything we don't. Okay. Left click. Uh, was it always left click? Oh, I don't remember. It's been too long. All right. Oh, the bioluminescence is back, baby. Unfortunately, it seems the scenic filter from the. Oh shit. We have a bit of a a bit of a. Storm going. That will stay underwater, of course. Fortunately, it seems the fi the filmic, scenic, uh, filter thingy did not did not survive. No, it's unfortunate. I love that. I love that preset. There was a there was a there was a like a filter you could enable to make the black slightly blacker and the white slightly whiter and it looked beautiful. Well, I need a I need a scanner. Uh, I need type. Titanium. Oh, sorry, hold up. Uh, let me, let me. Titanium and a battery, which means we need copper. Cop. Oh, and and the raboon plant. Electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. Okay. Raboon plants. We'll get them. We'll get them. Well, isn't that just something straight out of Japanese cartoons? Galena. Should be able to use this. What is Gal? New creature discovered. Hoopfish. I 
Oh shit, we got those penguin things. Let's see if they're hostile. They don't. Look, you know what the problem is with these fish? You're swimming just minding your own business. Maybe I'm going over there to that, to that weird, that thing, right? And then out of nowhere from the bottom of the ocean comes the apex hunter in this video game with a top of its head shaped like a spear sh shooting up from the fucking bottom pierces your fucking stomach eats your insides while you're still alive trying to think what just happened what hit me oh my god did i just get pierced by a spear and then it just claps open its mouth and it starts just mushing away on your entrails and you just we gotta exterminate these things because it's gonna be us or them I'm sorry. Fuck! I'm sorry, little penguin. Wait, they can they can breathe on the water. Fuck. Listen, if humanity is to survive on this planet, we need to do exactly what we did over here. Which means anything that can kill us is either gonna have to be domesticated, it's gonna have to learn to run at the very side of us, or it's gonna have to go extinct. And these motherfuckers, look at them. They got giant fucking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see those fucking teeth, bro. These things will fucking destroy you. I'm, I'm... Until I... I'll be back here with some weaponry. As soon as I have some. But for now, we're... For now, we'll have peace. For now. It's just a temporary truce, though. Don't, don't get too comfortable, you fucking... Death penguins. Teeth as sharp as razors. The peeper is back! The peeper is back do, 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 from outer space. Arctic peeper. Arctic peeper. Okay, let's uh, let's read a little. Right, we can we can pause now in the PDF. The PDF pauses the menu. Oh, that is amazing. <sighs> Equipment. Right. Um, tools and stuff, logs, vehicles, habitats, survival, arctic, logs and communication, no. Do we not have, uh, do we not have any, any kind of, like, equipment, no? No, not vehicles. What's that? Mobile vehicle bay, good old sea glide, of course. Fabricator, right, yeah, no. Oops. Or do we have to, we probably have to scan first, don't we? Oh, it does look very pretty. So we forgot this game will be released. Oh yeah, man, it's uh, it's it should be released uh, fairly shortly. Oh, okay, it should be released fairly shortly. It's pretty it's pretty cold outside apparently. I need to get back to my dropper. Oh my god, look at all these things here. Look at all this. All right, we'll start over here with this uh, little salt uh, salt pile. Galena outcrop. I gotta go scan this. Oh, there's lead. Oh, so many tools. Oh, man, the flares are no longer as bright. I like that. Oxygen. All right, let's attempt to find our uh, our little base again. Uh, it shouldn't be that far off. I think. Ooh. And the sky was red with blood at the coming of I don't know, Ragnarok? Look, we're 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 in we're in Valhalla now, alright? Gotta start using Viking terms. Cave. Okay. I'm already enjoying this game. This is good. Very pretty. Oh, they have rain particles now. Look. They have rain particles now. Rain. 
think I may have lost the pace. Don't worry, we'll find it again. What are you guys? Again. <laughs> if <laughs> Scra Scaly Maw and Moon. Okay. Oxygen. Oh, they added a choir to the music. Tell me added a choir to the music. Give me that again. Give me that. Ah. Oh shit, I'm over here. That means I should be somewhere over there. Yeah, they have it. Okay, I'm already liking what they're doing with the music. Alright, there's no sprint or anything. We're just slow as shit right now. We're looking for some creep vine and we're looking for our base. Mostly the base. Galena, titanium, rabone plant. No? What was that? Ah. Violetable. Oui. Oxygen. Is that a little snake? No, that's a plant. Sea snake plant. Alright. More of those. I don't feel safe around those. They already attacked me once. I mean, I may, I may have picked up, you know, I may have picked up one of their children. I may have made them a little aggressive, but, but I still don't trust them. They can literally just come up right from under you with that razor sharp beak with those massive claws, and that 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 thing is as big as their heads. It is their heads. Look, anything in the sea with that kind of mouth, I don't. I don't know what kind of carnivore penguins these are, but. Car carnivoric? I think we call that carnivorous. Look, carnivorous, carnivoric. When you're in the heat of combat, you're fighting for your life. There's massive monsters out there with heads filled with massive teeth. Carnivorous, carnivoric. It's all. It, it's all the same thing. It means. It means fight for survival. Your survival. Now, right now, they're look. Oh shit! It's the base. Okay, good. We need it. We need a knife first and foremost. We need that knife first and foremost, and we gotta keep down looking. Gotta keep on looking down. All right. Minerals galore. I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily, this mm. biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. Battery. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos Five. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Wait, so you have put yourself in this situation multiple times, and you keep doing it? This, is, this sounds like this sounds like an issue. Took him 10 minutes to kidnap a penguin baby. Man, we gotta exterminate all of these motherfuckers, okay? I'll, I'm, I'm just gonna keep it 100% 100 honest with you. First, okay, we're gonna need that scanner. We gotta cleanse the planet of these oh, carnivorous... Man, they're really bombing you with these entries. I'm not gonna look at them. I just, I just wanna see... Cooked Arctic people, cold and spongy. Never eat the antenna. Hoopfish. Man, it kind of looks like a, uh... Like a oh, they added a power bar to the... Yes. Alright, let's cure that peeper. Alright, that will stay well for a while. Give me... Uh... Just give me some copper wire for now, actually. Uh, we don't need some storage, I think. Though I will dump all of this into storage. Uh, get the Rabone plant, so keep that. This will this will keep well, at least if curing works the same as it used to. Uh, oh, they even add the bar for that. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm already liking the changes made in this game. All right, now we got to go back. Now we got to go back. Uh, let's, uh, let's do that. Oh. Right, now that we have a scanner, we can we can go scan the lunar plant? What? Scaly maw and the moon? Lunar plant. I 
And the game pauses while you attack. Yes. The lunar planet grows in shallow water. Can, can I can I can I conjure my inner David Attenborough? I have to say I'm not that good with my David Attenborough. It's not it's not great. <sighs> he fires the first shot against the penguins and then claims the problem. Look at their fucking mouths! Look, do I have to put on rules of nature as soon as we get a knife and just go ham? Because this is the rules of nature, all right? Strong versus the weak. Who lives, who dies? You think those things feed on fucking rocks? No, they eat plants. No, they don't eat plants. Look, you don't need those teeth to eat plants. They are carnivores. Look at them. It's them or the prey, okay? And they know that. They internalize that fact and they will accept that. Rules of nature. The lunar plant grows in shallow water. Branches grow off the main stem and create irregular rudimentary chambers. If one branch dies or is destroyed, the other branch chambers will utilize the nutrients left behind. Eventually, a new chamber will grow in the empty space. Yeah. Now I want to know what these things are because the scaly maw animal the scaly maw animal prefers shallow water and ample exposure to sunlight and exists in a symbiotic relationship with a species of vibrant algae that lives atop the animal's trunk these algae thrive in the sun and create a thin scaly bacterial mat around the superstructure of the anemone as they feed on other microorganisms that filter through the anemone's water space. Do we like it? How, how is that? Is that any good? I have, I have, I, uh, I, I, I don't know how that is. Is that good? Is that good? Let me know if that's good. Oxygen. Twisted mandrake. The twisted mandrake grows in temperate coral zones. Its leafy canopy photosynthesizes sunlight while providing shade to the bulbous structure underneath. Eh? Hey? hey, Brooks, welcome back, Matt. Yeah, we're we're trying uh, we're trying uh, blow zero. Actually, it's about to be um, right. Blow zero sunlight. Or below zero oxygen, which is a problem. Gonna go grab some beers and some snacks? Hell yeah! I mean, I stopped drinking, so I, I, I can't really do that myself. Don't want to do that either. Stopped drinking a long time ago. Or, when I say a long time ago, it's like a couple weeks now that I made the decision. And, uh, feels good so far. Haven't, haven't missed it. Haven't missed it. Shelf coral. A type of stony coral commonly found growing along rocky ledges. Stony corals have hardened biocomposite exoskeletons. The coral's polypus continuously grows upwards and outwards in thin layers, creating the grooved shelf appearance. The Sith Lord in his natural environment. Uh, we're not. We're not quite there yet. That is the natural environment, but we'll we'll get there. Don't worry. There are worse creatures. I hope so. I hope so. We'll, we'll probably find some along the way. Dutch gets the thermal knives. The penguins will be no more. Again, it's it's just look at those mouths, man. They come up. They mistake you for a fucking fish, and you're done. You're dead. Your internal organs ruptured. Everything dead. Those teeth get in your gut and you're gone. It's, it's gotta be this way, I'm sorry. This is a matter of survival. It is. He's been watching too many shows narrated by that one dude lately. Yeah, exactly. And he's awesome. The pink narrow leaf. This grass-like species grows in small clusters near coral bridges. What else can we find? <laughs> ice sheet. This sheet of ice has been in this ecosystem 
for 16 centuries, and it harbors the most wondrous plant life underneath. While it may seem cold to the touch, really extremophile bacteria can eat. Oh shit, look at these, they're no longer green. Dude, I didn't even recognize these as creep vines. I scanned them and I didn't even see them as, register them as creep vines. Creep vine, a kelp species concentrated in large forests, in shallow sandy waters. Loose roots anchor the plant to the seafloor, from where it grows steadily towards the surface in pursuit of sunlight. The stem is fibrosious and rich in iron, making it both a viable base material for fabrication of textiles as well as basic foodstuffs. Assessment, vital alien resource, edible construction applications. Dude, why did they not have David Attenborough narrate this thing? I mean, it would have cost them I don't know how much money it would have cost them, but it would be so worth it. Imagine if this game was fucking... If you had this, and you could press a play button, and it was and it was narrated by David Attenborough. Dude. <laughs> this game would sell copies just for that. Also, we got, we got a piece of the... Uh, right, yeah. Hello, can we maybe go up? We are not... Hello. We're dying right now. Man, this, this girl is... She's not very fast. I also have no idea where I am, so I should probably... That's, that's not my knife. What the fuck is that? That's another one of... Oh, no! Get, get back here, you little shit! That was a misclick. Can I lure him with a... No. Get, get over here, you fucking peeper. You will not escape my judgment. Thank you. The Arctic people. A fast prey fish camouflaged against the ice. Like the common people, it is fast and relatively intelligent, allowing it to survive in large numbers. Research notes. Don't like the auto-generated name. Suggest ice clops. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's bad, but it's pretty good, but it's bad. Oxygen. Ice clubs. Piss off. Oh, shit! Gotta fall! Hold up, hold up. I got music for this. I got music for this. Wait a minute. Wait. Uh, game, game capture on, so that the, so that... Okay, here we go. You guys should now still see the, uh, the thing when I'm... No, okay. Well, rip. Hold up, I got music for this. You saw what just happened there? I got music for this. No, 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 that's extended. I just need the normal one. Whoa, 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 hello! Hello, what the fuck happened? I can't move! I turned to literal fucking ice! Dude, that was metal as fuck. I think I just turned into a block of frozen shit. I fucking did. Yeah! This is what nature plan, bitch. Wait, can I can I now get a knife? I need that knife. Hold up. We'll get that knife and then we'll go and then we'll go back. Starving beast looking for its day to feast. A predator on the verge of death, close to its last breath. Creep vine sample, shit. Getting close to its last breath. Rules of nature. And a word when the sun comes up, with their lives on the line, alive, for a little while. Gotta follow the laws of the wild With their lives on the line um, Yeah! That's fucking... Only the strong survive Penguin? Oh, piss off, game. That's terrible. Penguin. Le less godly than they look. I know, right? Deception. And the agile prey 
No guarantee which of them will succeed, strong or weak. Whoa, shit, auction. Bam, na, 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 na. Some of those fucking creep vines. I don't know where they are, but I need a fucking knife. Those fuckers. Rules of nature. Rules of nature. Rules of nature, boys. I keep accidentally almost releasing this fish. I think I just need to eat it. Mmm. Rules of nature. Oxygen. I'm only 41 meters down, game! I'm f Actually, we're not fine. You're so slow in this game. Look at this shit. You can't do anything. Total deaths, 18. Man, I need to figure out how to reset that death count. You know what? Maybe I'll be able to figure that out real quick. Hold up. Let me see. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. 